Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor, and today we're going to be looking at all the different assets, and I'll explain each of them in the Unity's New Year Mega Bundle Sale for 2023, which runs from the 19th of January to the 9th of February, and this is going to be 95% off depending on the bundle that you take advantage of, and it's a set of curated arts and tools across these different Mega Bundles. So we'll go into them all, and be sure to check out my Patreon to also get access to 175 different scripts, assets, and projects and I'll leave all the links in the description for all the sales and more. So first of all, we've got the $29.99 bundle, which is a saving of up to 60%, which includes the Sprite Shaders Ultimate, which is compatible with all render pipelines. And this has 50 different stackable, highly performant different shaders, where you can do different fades, colors, custom dissolves, outlines and so much more and they can all be used together and the second one is the sci-fi turret constructor and this includes 70 different prefabs with different modules to create ultimate combinations of towers and turrets ranging from 500 to 3000 triangles with 4000 atlas textures pbr maps and you've got a bunch of over 15 different parts that you can customize with animations for the drones that come in the pack whether you need to repair hit death, idol, and so much more. We've got the Worms 3D characters, which is a set of two mythical worms, which you could look as Dragoner type characters with all realistic PBR models with 14 different animations for each, with one and two being over 20,000 triangles in each, with landing, taking off, idols, getting hit, flying, and lots of different animations included. The next bundle at $39.99, or more is a saving of up to 79% on three different assets, including the two that I just mentioned, which includes the collectible item visual effects. So this is a set of default Unity particle systems to collect rare items, rewards, and power-ups suitable for URP and HDRP, so you can edit colors, swap models, and do awesome effects. The next one is the Sci-Fi Space Base, which is a bit of a tongue twister, which has over 300 modular customizable prefabs for building your own base. It's designed to work with all rendering pipelines and you can fit everything together with customizable materials, animated doors, and delivers to create customized rooms with a whole bunch of prop libraries. And the last one in this bundle is the exporter for Unreal to Unity 2023 and is supported across Unreal versions 5.15 and 4.27. See, so this asset allows you to export LODs, collisions, actors, decals, spline meshes, any skin meshes or static meshes, terrains, materials, and textures directly from Unreal into Unity. And the last bundle of $44.99 or more of a saving of up to 95% is 10 different assets, including the ones I just mentioned. And then we've got Grab It, which is the editor physics transforms so this is a way to get realistic results when you want to place objects in your scene specifically with physics and this can help you create an organic look in your game without you specifically having to get each collider and put it really close to the ground and see is it clipping through is it not you get this and it can handle it all and make it look really nice and natural and then we've also got the sci-fi sound pack which is just added another 70 new sounds, but this has 790 high quality sci-fi effects for futuristic weapons, shields, electronic devices, spaceships, electronic doors, portals, and so much more. The Warrior Pack Mega Bundle, which includes 12 different Warrior Mechanim animation packs, whether that's Karate, Ninja, Swordsman, Sorceress, Knight, and so many others with 683 polished animations set up for Mechanim Humanoid controllers, fully clean and ready to go. The next one is the Easy AR and make awesome AR apps without any coding at all, suitable for the built-in render pipeline only. Then this is to help you build augmented reality apps and use gesture controls, object placement, and automatic lighting. Next one is Ivy Studio, the procedural vine generation. So spotted in all render pipelines, and this generates climbing plants and focuses on a realistic environment to adapt your vegetation around it. So you can set specific rules, use gravity, you can ungrow or grow, you can flatten the meshes, you can use full 3D branches to create stronger systems, you can limit the amount of ivy that grows with a grid-based system, LODs, you can export 
each of the assets to create specific prefabs if you need to save on performance. Next one is flex along 3D layouts, which is also supported in all render pipelines. So this asset lets you align and create and adjust 3D objects in different patterns, whether you need to do that in runtime or otherwise, you can do different sizing, fills, and margins so you can do it for spirals circles random layouts the next one is something called smooth sync then this allows you to have a drop-in solution to smooth the rigid bodies and transforms over a network which aren't often smooth whether using mirror pum pun2 unet or other networking solutions and this allows you to sync up vehicles character controllers and other objects with physics to make it smooth and nice on the eye the next one is the power slide cart physics and this is a straightforward solution for achieving smooth representative cart physics. You can have auto drifting, manual drifting, or you can have full manual for the easiest experience. And this comes supported out of the box with projectiles, turbo items, and examples to get your count racer completely going. The next one is the Pro Tips Tooltip System. And this is a tooltip system which works out of the box with both TextMesh Pro and Unity's built-in text, and it supports desktop and mouse hover events for pressing and clicking on touch devices, and it creates tooltips visually styled with Unity Canvas with 13 different templates, so many demos, and layered PSD files. Next one is the Sensor Toolkit 2, which is a collection of sensor components to detect objects around you and in the world, and this is supported in all of the render pipelines, works in both 2D and 3D, it's really lightweight and it's modular and it has lots of integration to be able to scan for those objects for you to be able to customize and this is fully scriptable and ready to use the next one is the skill and attack indicators and this again is supported in all three pipelines and this allows you to have easy visualization for skills and attacks on different players so you can choose one of the indicators and you can configure the texture and the settings as you go so it's got line arc circles scatter supports both 2d and 3d with 21 different textures you can use projectors and it is supported in loads of different assets too and last but not least in this pack is something called pixelate and this is supported in built-in and urp so this is a way to create 3d animations into a pixel art style sprite sheet so it takes 3d and turns it into a 2d system and this can react to 2d real-time lighting so you can create instances have it fully in real time the normal map will react to the 3d lighting you can have live pixelated previews you can export animations to any resolutions you have full control over the animation frame rate there's a flexible interface also be sure to check out all the links in the description because there's some awesome humble bundle content that's appeared which include a full set of hundreds of tutorials to get yourself started in game dev also books related to unity 3d and learning game development and a few others i'll put below be sure to check out my patreon to get access to over 175 different scripts assets and projects you cannot find anywhere else do come and check out my great assets on the unity store and on my website all the bonus savings big thank you to all my patrons including peter steiner raheem whittaker manas Barakas, walter dunson rene leisure Alyssa faden daniel getterjank ishikawa takuya hush thomas mercileski callum murray mark rondu marvin church hoglan naigoyan thomas lopez curry for life gaming sungji park mercury 27 brandon manion austin certain gene y quaint Duan Cooper, James McCarthy, Johanna Lixon, Leslie Winter, Kelvin Martin, Heather Fletcher, Connor Draws, Mark Vacon, Jose Herrera, Andre Ferreira, Larry Antu, Patrick Dominowski, Dylan C, Pablo, Liam Gray, Eric Yun, and Weebin Lin. And thank you to everybody else who comes to watch the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.